uh, Marie, in your book, Tending the Family Heart, uh, you have a great, great, great concept in there. You say that family is a verb. Uh, can you tell us more about that? Thanks, Dan. Um, well, what I simply meant is that family is something you do. Mm. It's not something that is. Mm. I mean, anybody can make a group of people and call it a family, but one of the things we are experiencing in these letters we get from everywhere is that just because people live in the same house mm -hmm. doesn't mean that they feel connected. And I think there are lots of um, stressors on families now that mm -hmm. make it even more difficult mm -hmm. for family members to feel connected. Yeah. Um, it, the internet is wonderful as it is, and right. let's face it, what we're doing today is going to be on the internet. There it is. Um, it, it is wonderful, but we're also seeing families where uh, people go off in their various corners with their phone and their texting and their computers and their TVs mm -hmm. and never talk to each other. Right. So what I call the heart of the family is that feeling of we're in this together, we're us, we're connected, that we have a sense of a family identity, we're the family who, mm. that people feel cared about, that they feel like this is where I get um, mm. love, nurturance, support. And that heart part of the family doesn't happen by accident, mm -hmm. at least not most of the time. Right. Now, there are some families, there are some parents who just know how to do that. Yes. They grew up in families where the heart was beating very strongly yeah, yeah, <laughs> themselves. Yeah. And so, of course, when they go to have families of their own, um, then they know that they kids need attention and they mm -hmm. spend time together and they make it a point to do mm -hmm. particular rituals at different parts of the year, all the mm -hmm. things that make that heart part of the family mm -hmm. strong. But between the computer age, uh, unemployment, the economy stinks, we've mm -hmm. got overstressed parents who are working two and three jobs. Right. Um, we have now so many kids being raised by families where they are with the partner of the partner of their original right, mom, right, right. that um, the family feels very disjointed and sure. disconnected. So I named this book Tending the Family Heart because I love the word. I mm -hmm. love the word tending. It's like tending a campfire. Mm, if you right. light a campfire and then you just leave it alone, yeah. it's going to go out. Yes. <laughs> it's just going to go out. Great so metaphor. we need to tend our families in the same way. And what the book is about is, okay, if you feel like your family's getting a little too disconnected, mm -hmm. if you feel like you don't really know this particular child, mm -hmm. if you feel like your adolescent is now out of control and you don't have any emotional connection anymore, mm -hmm. that there are actually very practical ways to nurture that part of your family and to tend the heart. Mm. It's really important to provide children with that structure so that they can mm. turn around and be the kind of parents yeah. who can tend their own family's heart. Yes, yes. So um, I, I think it's a, it's a essential concern right now um, is how to make our families work better. Yeah, and, and, and you've made it very available. It's, a, it's an e-book. It's an e-book. Uh, so, yeah. I mean... Uh, I'm, try I'm trying to be hip even yeah. though I'm old, you know? <laughs> Oh, it is an ebook, book cool. um, yeah. and it's available, of course, through psychcentral.com and also Amazon and Barnes & Noble. So thank you. Fabulous.